Okay, I've got another game. I've got two more games, two more dating sims. All right, welcome to Super Seducer. Uh, I don't know what to expect going in, but one thing that I do want to say before we start is that uh, the developer of this game left a note on it saying, hey, we will let you make any form of content talking about this, whether good or bad, we don't care. Which I have to say major respect because initially seeing this game, I wanted to make fun of it, but now I don't know. They seem a little bit self-aware. Let's let's just find out. If we used real a seduction guru. Jeez. I like how he has a chess game. He has a chess game on his desk. The true seduction is that you have to beat him at chess and then he allows you to be seduced. What is this guy? What did he live through? Diff is this guy like a interview with a vampire type guy where he like lived through multiple? What the heck? I'm already waiting for the cringe awkwardness. Oh, oh, okay. Um, <laughs> talk to her for from a few meters in front of her and slightly to the side. What? But what am I going to say? Wolf Whistle is a definite no-no, obviously. We we all know that. How about we just wait until she's... Uh, I don't know. I wouldn't say anything. If I saw an attractive girl walking past me, I would just let her go. I would be like, wow, that girl was really attractive, and then go about my day. I feel I would feel like bad for any girl that's like just trying to go about their day, and then someone's like, hey, this is not the opportune moment to meet someone. I don't know. But I'm I am not a seduction guru. And I'm learning. And I am I am just a lowly troglodyte and I am learning. So let's see. Uh wait until she's passing you, then talk to her. Let's do that. Oh, wait. Enter. Excuse me. Just want to ask you something really I'm busy. quick. <laughs> 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 That failed because you gave you made it too easy for her to just walk past you and brush you off too close to the side. It means that she will likely do that as a reflex like 90% of the time. Bro, I think she was just busy. I think you're looking into it. Dude, this guy, maybe this guy like got rejected quite a bit as like a younger dude. And then over the years, like he, he would get rejected by a girl and then go home and then write in his journal like this is why this failed. <clears throat> this music too. correct when you stop a girl on the street you need to be directly in front of her and also leave enough space so that she can slow down and comfortably stop i think you're really beautiful i'd love to go down on you right now <laughs> uh, hey don't i know you from one of my yoga classes uh didn't we both go to the same college I can't remember exactly what I would say, but it was something along those lines of like, hey, do not do you go to blah, 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 college? Whatever. You start a conversation. Oh, that's cool. How long have you been going there? I thought I recognized you. You know, but this, uh, I don't know. This guy is the seduction guru, and he might ask her to play a game of chess. I don't know. Let's see. I am but a lowly piece of filth who needs to learn how to be a seduction master from the guru. So let's let's continue. I'm sorry, seduction guru. I'm actually going to the park Sorry. Uh, to feed the yeah. squirrels with my friend. What? Feed squirrels? Yeah. And ducks? And ducks or <laughs> squirrels? <laughs> no, just the squirrels. <laughs> These we, uh, little guys, yeah? Yeah, we got them to be our friends. What do you of. feed them? Like hot dogs? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, almonds? Almonds? Yeah. That's their favorite, is it? It seems to be. That's nice. Well, they're really cute, aren't they? They are very cute. You yeah, like animals? <laughs> I do. Mm, nice. Yeah. That mm. sounds fun, actually. I never thought of that. But buy some almonds, go feed the squirrels. They're really cute, aren't they? Those little fuzzy creatures. They really do fascinate me. I'm talking about humans, of course. They fascinate me. Ask her questions to get her to do most of the talking. You do most of the talking. You're just so beautiful. Would you mind if I kissed you right now? Lean in for the kiss. Okay, obviously. Come on. Uh, ask her questions to get her to do most of the talking. People don't like talking about themselves when they're not asked something because I feel like most of the time people will be like oh I don't want to sound conceited or pretentious or self-centered but if you're asking someone something let them talk you know but that's that's just let's see 
Do you live local around here somewhere? Yeah. That's nice. And do you spend a lot of time in this area? Um, I do, yeah. There's a nice coffee shop just down there. Have you been there? I have, um, but I'm going to meet a friend actually, so I need to go. Okay, what's her name? Is it a he or a she, actually? In the beginning, the girl actually shouldn't do most of the talking, so you don't want to ask a bunch of questions. You want to make statements <laughs> and do most of the talking yourself. Okay, well, okay, let's, 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 get, let's get that. It's obviously really tailored for him to seem very, like, knowledgeable on the subject, so that's fine. That's fine. I won't judge him just yet, but definitely judging him. You do most of the talking. Okay. Yeah, I was <clears> just <throat> walking. There's a nice park down there, and then just I'm going to meet question. some friends, but I've got, like, 40 minutes, and that's why when I saw you, and I thought you looked friendly, so that's why I came over and said hi. Okay. <laughs> in the early stages of like a nice spot where they rent out bikes and it's on the lake. And yeah, all that. but you, you ride bikes in that? Well, I'm English. <laughs> <laughs> you know what we do, like the penny farthing and the, the suit on okay. and sitting really up, up straight. That's very no, fancy I'm, for bikes. I'll, I will change. <coughs> okay. okay, that was actually kind of cute and charming. I, I will admit that if someone like pulled the whole, oh, well, I'm English, I'd be like, okay, that's that's charming. That's charming. So I, I will give him that. He he does know how to talk to girls for sure, but also I feel like there has there there should have been multiple takes on some of these. I also like how if you make a bad decision, the girls aren't next to him in the little like side shot. But if you make a good decision, there's just a girl like laying down next to him, and one of them's like looking off to the distance, trying not to smile. I swear to God, like next time you see that shot, uh, look at the blonde girl behind him. She's like trying not to laugh. Asking what someone does is that kind Look of at the blonde girl. question that we always ask. She's trying not to laugh. <laughs> Look at her. If you want to make a guess, make an assumption, it makes it a little bit more interesting. <laughs> She's and trying not to laugh. If you choose something to do with fashion or art, <clears throat> it's always a compliment for a woman because it kind of says that she has... I'm not even paying attention to what this guy's saying. I'm just looking at her face. And tell me what you do because you, you look a bit artistic. <laughs> um. uh, what was that? What did you just say to her? Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, She's like... Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm immature. Could you please tell me what you do? Because uh, you look, uh, I look a bit what? Continue. But switch to talking about life philosophy. How many people you know that do that and you get annoyed whenever they try and switch to that? Yeah, I work in IT and actually I love my job. I think that, <laughs> uh, you know, people think IT is boring, but at the moment it's like the most exciting <clears throat> Field, right to work in she so many did not cool companies no. I really love my job so happy to, <laughs> to go to work every day and um, yeah it's fascinating for me that's great sure okay Put it in there. Uh, they, she she offered to give me her number so <clears throat> ew don't stand there like that Ugh. Ew, that stare. You did pretty well. You didn't get the very best result, which meant that you made a few decisions that weren't quite ideal, but you did enough to get the result and see the girl again. You got the number, so well done. Thank you. Hey, thanks, man. Well, let's see what we did. And if you choose something to do with fashion or art, it's always a compliment for a woman because it kind of says that she has style. Rather than just so lie. her name, you can always introduce yourself. It's a little bit different to what most I mean, if someone looks artistic, then yeah, I'll say it, but... When you're speaking if someone comes out in, like, a Forever 21 outfit, I'm not going to be like, wow, you've got great fashion. I'm going to be like, yeah, I know. My mom used to shop for that when I was a kid. Go out and you got the number, so well done. Thank you. Thank you. That's very nice of you to say that, but let's let's be honest here. He said the whole thing about, like, stopping the girl on the street. Dude, she asked you usually stop girls on the streets. Like, do you want to be that honest about it and be like, yeah, all the time I try and actually I'm a, I'm a seduction guru. But anyways, hopefully he's got nicer threads in the next chapter because I got to say that look wasn't really doing it for me. But that's just me. Let's play the next level. Hey, thanks for watching. If you want to see more content like this, consider subscribing or catch me on stream Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. If you want to be a part of the community, you can join by clicking the Discord link in the description below. Thanks again.